What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Storm Striker SX9 here with another Storm Striker SX9 plays RPG game. The next game I will be playing is Neverwinter Nights Enhanced Edition. I got this on Steam. You can also find this on GOG. And you can also find this on the Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, and I believe it's on the PS4 as well. That's new, actually. This game is on console, so yeah. Um, this is the enhanced edition of The Mortal Knights. And yeah, um, as usual, I'll be playing this game casually. Game Overs and Deaths included. Let me turn down the uh, audio here. Okay. Let's start a new game here. As you can see, there are four campaign, three campaigns you can choose, as well as custom modules made from the Com Neverwinter Nights community as well as other fan-made modules that you guys out there make, of course. But we'll be taking a look at the main game because this is our first look at this game. So, Alright, we can either start with the prelude or we can go with chapter one right off the bat. So, I think I'm going to do the prelude. And then let's see if there's any pre made characters for this first look rather than actually making one. Ah, perfect. This will do Bowser Storm Raid. Oh, give it a minute. Loading, loading, loading. Give a dog a bone. There we go. Okay. Bowser Storm. That's still a bad portrait. Ooh, ooh. I think I'll go with that one. It's not bad. Okay. Get on them! Attack, I say! To the fight, my friends! Attack! Attack! Kill them! Attack! I'm gonna go with that. Alright. The Frozen North. The name given to the stark and unforgiving frontier that lies beyond the high moor of Faerun. A bleak wilderness where barbarian clans and tribes of giants roam the land and fierce dragons rule the skies. But amidst the frozen savagery stands a bastion of civilization, the city of Neverwinter, jewel of the north. Behind the city's high walls, those are both hardy and brave carve out an existence from this bleak land under the guidance and protection of the legendary hero, Lord Nasher Alagonda. Yet there are some things that all the courage in the world cannot stand against. 
A virulent plague swept the city. A terrible affliction that began in the beggar's nest. Soon, all of Neverwinter would feel the touch of the wailing death. The disease could not be cured. Panic ensued. The streets erupted into violence. The jewel of the North was brought to its knees. To save Neverwinter, Lady Aribeth de Tilmoran, Paladin of Tyr, and Lord Nash's right hand put forth the call for a champion. A rush of would-be heroes answered her call, some drawn by promises of grandeur and glory, others by the lure of gold. Those with the greatest potential were initiated into the academy to train and study under the greatest minds of Neverwinter, all in the hopes a champion might emerge to save the city from the wailing death and whatever sinister force might be behind it. All right, that was a pretty good intro. Finally, you're up. I was afraid you were going to sleep all day. I guess the instructors work you pretty hard here at the Academy. My name's Pavel. I'm one of the new recruits. I just arrived here at the Academy this morning. Is it true that what they say about you? That Lady Arabeth herself ordered the Academy to send you an application to come here for training? I've never heard of anyone being invited to train at the Academy before. Usually people are begging to get in. It must be a great honor for you. I've got three choices here. It is both an honor and a privilege for me to serve Neverwinter. When you have as much talent and skill as I do, you get used to these kind of honor. Who cares about honor? I just came because I sense the potential for real profit. You're pretty full of yourself. Hope you have the skills to back up that confidence. But for some of us, things don't come that easy. My brother Bim and I were working on one of the nearby farms outside the city when we heard Lady Arabeth had put out a call for heroes to come to the aid of Neverwinter. We knew the city was suffering, but we didn't realize how bad things were until we got here. We arrived just before they sealed the gates and quarantined the city. Thank the gods I, I got accepted into the academy. I, would, I wouldn't want to be out there on the streets with the plague, not with the city guards barely able to keep order anymore. Got four choices here. I don't actually know mu that much about the plague. What did you mean about the city guard barely able to order? Tell me about your brother. I'm not really interested in chatting with him. Hmm. The Wailing Death is a plague worse than any recorded in the entire history of Neverwinter. The whole city has been quarantined. Nobody is allowed in or out. The Neverwinter Melta militia do their best to enforce the quarantine but people don't like being trapped inside the walls of a plague-infested city. Every day, more bodies pile up in the streets and the citizens move one step closer to panic and open rebellion. Can't say I blame them. It's only been a few months and already the dead number in that 
in the thousand. Couldn't someone be looking for a cure? Couldn't the clerics and priests do anything to help? Sounds like the whole city is doomed. Great story. I'll be going now. Most people have given up any hope of finding a cure for the Wailing Death. Potions and medicinal herbs do nothing. Even the prayers of the city's most powerful clergy have been ineffective. I guess that's why Lady Arabeth ordered the academy to open its doors to recruits. The city needs a hero, someone who can save us all from the Wailing Death. The word on the street is that Arabeth is actually working on a cure right here in the academy, but that's just a rumor. Probably not even true. Can you tell me anything else about the plague? Do you have anything more about these rumors of a cure? Anything else you could tell me? I think it's time to go for me to go now. Yeah, I guess you want to get on with your training. Well, good luck, Bowser. Who knows, maybe the next time we meet, the rumors of a cure for the Wailing Death will turn out to be true. Don't forget to say hi to my twin brother, Ben, over there by the door on the way out. I saw you talking to my brother, Pavel. My name is Bim. If you want, I can give you a short tutorial on adventuring. I'm not interested in a tutorial. Loot yourself. You should go through this door. Speak to old, old, older. Then they'll get you set up with all the equipment you need to finish your training here at the academy. Yeah, there's a lot of reading in this game, so yeah, a lot of talking involved. Hello there. Come to get yourself some supplies from old Olga, have you? Good idea. Can't have you wandering about the streets naked. Might give the Academy a bad name. The city guards are already having enough trouble maintaining control as it is. Plague bodies pile a, pile a dozen deep in the gutters. The Wailing Death running unchecked through the districts. Horrible, I say. The city guards are already having enough trouble maintaining control as it is. Oh, I heard. Really? I was about to say it twice. Unexpected loading. But you've heard all this before. I'm sure. Here, I've got some equipment for you. A fighter like you might find it handy in completing your training. Now, if you're ready, I'll give you a tutorial on how to access your inventory so you can use that equipment I just gave you. I already know how to use my inventory. Well then, I guess we don't need to go over it, do we? Oh, this might be a good time to teach you how to use the stores in the game. You might want to purchase. Since you're part of the Academy, you get a special discount rate. Are you interested in seeing my store? I'll give you a quick tutorial on how they work too. I don't need a tutorial on how to use the stores. I'm pretty sure a lot of you out there know how to do it too. Okay, I'm not one to go fretting on when the listener already knows what I'm saying, so you want to see my inventory now? Yes. Great, I'm sure you'll find my prices most reasonable. When we're done, you'll find the door leading out of this room is unlocked. Weapon. Armor. Weapon. 
Yep. Faster sword plus one. I think I'm good on stuff. Yeah, I'm good. Let's go. Let's go, shall we? Hey there! You're one of the students here at the Academy, aren't you? Bowser, unless I'm mistaken. I'm Burna, an instructor here at the Academy. If you like, I can give you a quick tutorial on how to use your map in the journal. Not interested. Well, if you change your mind, I'll be right here to help you out. Is there anything else I can do for you? Goodbye, Bowser. It's about time you showed up, recruit. My name is Herban. But as far as your worthless hide is concerned, you just call me Sir. As far as your worthless hide is concerned, you could just call me Sir. It's my job to teach you raw recruits some tips on combat techniques so you maggots don't get gutted out. That in the real world. Sir, I'm ready, sir. Let's go, man. That's what I like to hear, recruit. With that attitude, yeah. you might actually make something of yourself in this world. This information might save your life sometime. Recruit, so listen up. Whenever you want to use a feat or special attack on an enemy, right click on your opponent to bring up the menu. Yeah. Then, left click the special attack icon in the lower right corner of the menu. This opens up a second menu with any feats or special attacks you might have. Just left click on the attack or feat you want to do. You follow me so far recruit? Sir, yes sir! Oh, the special attacks menu. You will also see the fairy icon located in the very top in the 12 o'clock position. Left click on this icon whenever you want to enter parry mode. And when parrying, you do not attack, but you are able to make an opposed deck to deflect or dodge any incoming attacks that would otherwise hit you. Each round, you can parry one successful enemy attack for each attack you would normally get. You roll, if your roll succeeds by 10 or greater, you will make a free counter counterattack at no penalty. To return to normal combat mode, simply left click on your phone. Have you got that figured out, recruit? Can we move on to the next lesson? Yeah, yeah, I've got it. No need to shout and holler. If I don't shout, recruit, might not get through that big layered of dung covering your brain. Now listen up for the next session. Your weapon isn't just for killing, recruit. Sometimes it has other uses, like opening a chest or locked door. If you find a lock, you can get past. Right click on the door or chest, then select the bash icon from the menu. You can even do this with missile weapons. The stronger you are, the easier it is to bash open a lock. Remember that, not all locks can be opened by force. Are we clear so far, Recruit? I got it, let's move, let's move the show along. When a giant is ripping you from your lips off for talking back, Recruit, just remember that somewhere in I'll be smiling. Now quit goofing off and stay sharp. I've done my part. The rest is up to you, yeah. recruit. Time to prove yourself by facing one of the Academy's combat paths. Go speak to my assistant, Corporal Dandy, at the south southeast end of the room. Test you in the melee weapon. Then, for your test in combat, range combat, and missile comp weapons, 
speak to Corporal Hewitt over near the West Well. Geez, you talk a lot, mister. Sir, Herbin sent you over for your combat trial, did he? I am ready for my combat trial. To Hewitt to continue your test. Go and talk to Hewitt to continue your test. Anyways. Nice shot. I need to talk to you about I guess congratulations are in order. You passed the combat trial and completed your basic training. Your days at the academy are finally over. Thank you. Goodbye. Obviously, I'm not going to say everything because, like I said, there's a lot of talking and reading. Now that you've finished your training, you can go on into the South Assembly Hall if you want. Lady Arabeth is still granting blessings to all the Academy graduates. I'll be going now. Go on into the assembly hall whenever you're ready. That guy was a mouthful to talk. Use my voice on. Congratulations! Your training here at the Academy is now complete. May the blessing of Tear be upon you. I have been looking forward to meeting you. The instructors here at the Academy speak very highly of your skills. I am Lady Erebeth de Tilmeran. Perhaps after the graduation ceremonies, we can speak in private. Neverwinter can use someone like you. We should arrange to... Wait, what was that? Did you feel it? Brace yourself, we are under attack. I must speak with you. Listen to me. There is not much time. I fear this is no random attack we have suffered. As you may already know, a number of creatures were brought from Waterdeep here to the Academy. It was believed the reagents for a spell to create a cure could be extracted from them. We tried to keep this information secret. But this attack reveals our secret is well known, even to our enemies. Enemies? Who are these enemies you speak of? Neverwinter has many enemies. Some declare themselves openly, such as the city of Luskin. Others keep their identities hidden from us, striking from the shadows. Continue. I do not know who is behind this attack. But it is obvious they are here to destroy our hope of ending the Wailing Death. Continue. You must protect the Water Davian creatures. They must not be allowed to fall into the enemy's hands. Where can I find these creatures, Lady Araba? I would take you to the creatures myself if I could. 
But I fear my presence would make protecting the creatures more difficult, if not impossible. Continue. Our attackers appeared here in this room. It is likely their arrival was magically centered on me. They must have assumed I would be with the Watadavian creatures. Continue. Even now, our enemy may be watching me through magical means, hoping I will lead them right to where the creatures are kept. I cannot take that risk. Continue. You must do this alone. Go back through the hallway leading to this room and take the corridor to the east. It leads to the chambers where the Water Davian beasts are being kept. I will do as you command, Lady Arabath. Take this key. It will open the locked east door back in the hallway leading to this room. I will stay here. Hopefully my presence will draw the enemy away from the creatures they seek. Continue. Hurry! Make your way into the hall and then to the chambers down the east corridor. That is where the Watadavian beasts are kept. Continue. The fate of Neverwinter depends on you. This key will open the door. May Tyr be with you. In dialogue. All right. Nothing walks away. Now we get into some combat. Gonna change over to the sword I had before. There we go. I long to see the blade into some goblin fashion. I long to crack a goblin with the mace to the skull. I long to crack a goblin skull with a face. I got that one mixed up. Oh well. that and we go this way and there's Pavel thank the gods you're here 
I thought those goblins were going to be the death of me. It's me, Pavel, remember? Yes, yes, I remember. Skeletons? Who brought skeletons with you? Who Nothing wants to watch the skeletons' phones fly? Fly and make a jingling sound. Just fine. I have nothing more I can teach you. I am too old to go with you, but South Door is now open for you. Beyond, you will find chambers leading to the Waterdavian creatures. If the attackers have not taken you already. Let's go. take on all of these creatures because by the time we're done with all of them it'll be an hour long video I don't I see the skeleton heard us and followed us let's go and there's another one there we go perfect Let's go. For skeleton. For tunnel. For Digima. The nymph has fled. The Yonti and the other creatures have escaped into the streets of the city. And where was Arabeth during all this? I have come from Arabeth. He sent me to protect these creatures. You? Did Arabeth really expect a, a whelp such as this to be able to defend the water Davian creatures? Is she really so blind to the truth, Fenthic? Yes, sir. I will have you no, speak no more ill of Lady Arabeth. Did what she thought was best. Bah! I know of the feelings you and Lady Arabeth have for each other, but if does nothing, but it does nothing to change the facts. 
she was wrong to bring the creatures here. I will leave you and your lady stop to clean up this mess. Uh. Excuse me. You must forgive the The strain of the way the death lays in the lands. As their leader, Dester has worked long and hard to help ease the suffering of Neverwinter. And this most recent setback has upset him greatly. I'm Better. Pedlick Moss, priest of Tyr and companion of the Lady Arabeth. You must be the student Arabeth told me about. Yes, I am Bowser. Daster and I arrived with the reinforcements shortly after the attack began. If we found Arabeth in the south, the Sibley Chamber, hard pressed by a dozen of mysterious assailants, managed to drive off the attackers, and Arabeth told us she had sent one of the on ahead to defend the water deviant creatures. They, while Arabeth tended to the wounded, one of the mages had arrived with the reinforcements teleported Dasher and me to this room. Alas, we arrived to find the mages unturned. <laughs> the end. You know who attacked the academy? We have no clue as to who planned the attack, and I doubt any prisoners we take will know anything about who is truly behind them. Can you? A few straggling goblins are all that remain of our attack, but I fear we have lost this battle. The water demon creatures are gone. In any case, I think I will stop this conversation. It's getting really long. I will meet you at the Hall of Justice within the week then. In dialogue. Long conversation is going to make the hour a long video. I, I, I don't need In one brutal attack the promise of those at the academy had been all but snuffed out. Hope disappeared with the water deviant creatures, and the weight of the terrible sickness pressed down on the city once more. Even more chilling, the whispered rumors of enemies seeking to destroy Neverwinter from within had proved true. Though the identity of those responsible for the slaughter was as yet unknown. Still, a flicker of hope yet remained, for not all had died in the attack. From the bloody carnage at the academy, a survivor had stepped forward, a champion to carry the torch in this darkest hour. All right, guys, I think that'll be it for this video. If you enjoyed this game of Novel Winter Nights Enhanced Edition, please leave a like, comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button, and also click that notification bell to know when I upload new videos. And I will see y'all next time. If you enjoyed this game, I may do more of this. Until then, this will be a first look at this game, and I will see y'all next time.